in today's session we are going to study in detail a topic from teaching aptitude that is called as swayam prabha now many of you have a query whether the channels are 32 34 or something else so let me tell you this video will clear all your doubts with all the 40 channels understanding them in detail with different categories so yes let's in detail understand this topic of swayam prabha with the help of this today's session hello students welcome to global online and on global online we have started preparation classes for your ap set examination wherein we have brought paper 1 complete course now this complete course is will be conducted in english as well as in hindi and this courses will be conducted daily live at 9 pm the speciality about this course is that this course will have full syllabus video lectures including topic wise mcqs and full syllabus notes which can be downloaded in pdf format at the same time you have full syllabus mock test and 2000 plus mcqs practice questions which will help you to crack your examination in a very systematic way in order to understand how to avail this course and how to access this course you have to go to google play store download the app that is called as global online app registered yourself with the registered mobile number once you registered yourself you will be able to see the courses now in that you have to cl click your ap that is andhra pradesh set examination once you click on that and once you pay the fees you will be able to access all the details very well where you have the theory classes the uh, the mcqs preparation and much more which will help you to crack your examination uh, let's see exactly what swayam prabha is and how this topic preparation is going to help you with you know with your understanding as well as able to understand and crack the question you know with respect to this particular topic now so yes when we are talking about swayam prabha i have given you a screenshot of a portal just to give an authentication it is mentioned very well that swayam prabha now is a group of 40 dth channels now till the time it was not reflected on the website we were not sure about it but it has been reflected that it has number of channels as 40 channels we'll be seeing the details in the coming slides but remember these 40 channels are updated we had 32 3, from 32 we had 34 and from 34 now is number of channels is 40 and this was a very sure question because whatever books you have taken those books are you know they are not for the latest version so there you just have to write somewhere you know you just make a note in your books or notes whatever whichever you are referring that swayam prabha channels are now 40 in number so let's understand what exactly swayam prabha is it's free dth channel for education very very important dth very small small things also you have to keep in mind so i've written over here very clearly dth is nothing but direct to home channels with a high quality educational program 24 by 7 it means it is it doesn't stop it is you know continuously circulating with the help of gsat that is geo stationary satellite so this in this slide see i have kept it very crisp and very specific what is swayam prabha it's a free dth channel for education that is direct to home channel with a high quality of education 24 by 7 via g satellite that is geo stationary satellite 15 right now how the contents are reflected of swayam prabha that is 4 hours which will be repeated 5 times a day so on this also you will be getting a statement questions that how these contents are repeated at least after 4 hours which will be repeated 5 times a day 5 or more times a day so that students have a flexibility to get you know the things on their as per their convenience these channels are linked with bsap that is linked from bsat that is nothing but baskara baskara acharya national institute for space application and geo informatics very important this can come for your uh, full form that is acronym they can give and the contents are provided by neptel iits ugc cc and igno and these are all you know the coordinators of your swayam so this also i have given you in the last class so students those who have not seen last class part 1 can go back to part 1 and then you can come to this part 2 uh, of the session and this is maintained where the web portal is maintained by it is maintained with the help of information and library network now again in a statement question they can give you which was disciplines this swayam prabha uh, 
uh, includes. So it is start, starting with arts, science, commerce, social science, humanities, engineering, law, medicine, agriculture. So make sure that you are very well versed with the number of uh, domains also, disciplines also. There can be a question based on the disciplines which should you will be able to write. Now, Poyam Prabha, these DTA channels, are, they are divided into three categories. One is the higher education, next is the school education, and then we have is competitive education, right? So now see, we, as I said, there are 40 channels, but description on the website is only about 34. They will be adding the next channels. So when I say higher education, it talks about disciplines, as I said right now. Art, science, commerce, very important. You should know this very well because in statement question, they can catch you. Engineering, technology, law, medicine, agriculture, which are uh, all the courses are certified uh, by the detail offering through Swayam, which we did yesterday in part one. And the platform is developed for offering MOVE courses also. Right. School education that is from class 9 to 11, wherein, you know, all the, uh, the train teacher training as well as the teaching and learning aids are provided in order to understand the subject better and make sure that, you know, the students are preparing themselves for the exams or the professional degree. Competitive exams, this we are going to do in detail also, higher education, what, school education, what, competitive education, what. But remember one thing, when I talk about school education uh, under the Swayam Prabha portal, it is the PM e Vidya. Actually, this started with on May 9th, 30th May 2020, that is during the pandemic time. Prior to this, there was no channel dedicated to school education. The reason is that, you know, uh, with the pandemic situation, we understood that, okay, this can be a scenario and there should be no stoppage for students learning. Okay, and that's the reason this channel uh, came into consideration. Now, if you see the bifurcation of the channels, that can be a type of question also. Channel 1 to 10 and 21, they are managed by Consortium of Communication, UGC. 11 to 16 and 22nd channel is managed by Neptune. 17 to 20 channel is managed by IGNU. 22 to 30 channels are managed by primary for primary education. 31 and 32 channel by secondary and 33 and 34 higher secondary. So now this I have specified and this is not being uh, mentioned by my own. You can go to the Swayam portal and all this is given. Now the reason I'm saying that I'm not telling you to go to the portal and learn. The portal, the moment you go to the web portal of Swayam, that is a website of Swayam, there are so many information, you know, which does need search, certain filtering. So I'm not telling you that, okay, go and open the website and learn. I have made specific notes for you, which will help you to understand, you know, the subject very well, the topic very well. So you don't have to, you know, keep on struggling between the website. These notes are enough for you to refer and prepare yourself for the examination, right? Now, see, I have for your understanding, I have listed all the names of channel numbers and the names. So channel one, okay. Uh, Vagesh channel 2 is Sanskriti, Prabhod, then we have Saraswat, P. Saraswat, uh, Prabhavand, Vidhik, Kautilya, uh, channel 8 is Aryabhat, 9 is Pandan, uh, 10 is Daksh, uh, 11 is Ignu, 12 is Ignu with uh, social sciences and applied sciences. So it is different. So all this list you know, is given to you till channel number 40, right? Now, the reason to give it to you very crips, obviously, I've taken it from the website, but I want it to hit your eyes again and again, and you should know these channels now. These channels has to be known with their numbers and with their name. Any type of mass the following. Now, they are coming with the questions. Students of this cycle, that is December 2023 cycle, said that, Definitely the questions are coming on the based on the channel. So what channel is based for what? That we will be able to do it when we know. I just want you to make sure first you know the channel numbers very well. So it's very important for you to understand the channel numbers very well and make sure that you are well versed with the channels and what these channels does. Okay, so like for example, Vagish is nothing but, you know, language and literature. Sanskriti is nothing but with talks about history, culture and uh, philosophy. Who takes care of the channel? That is also very well mentioned. And what the channel does is also mentioned, right? So as I said, one, two, channel number 10, if you can see, okay, all are being taken by CEC and UGC. 
okay and if you see channel number 21 again so this is year 21 which is again handled by uh, uh ugc and ct this is concert consortium of communication for communication so you should know these details very well so basically if I, you know, if I just tell you to, oh, sorry, if I tell you to revise this, this table is very important for you. Based on this table, I have made this next table for you to understand, right? So in this part one, very small topic we have taken, Swayam Prabha, what are the number of channels, what type the channels do, from where they have been uplinked, from where they have been, you know, uh, what type of, uh, who maintains the website portal is all given to you. How does the content comes, what type of disciplines they take is also given, right? Then I have given you a description about the channels. They are divided into three channels, that is higher education, school education and competitive exams. If you go on the website, this is, Probably there, but to make it little bit easier, I have made it very clear for you. The channels are, you know, divided into what and they are managed by whom. And for that, I have given you the chart also. Entire chart is given to you. So help. Well, let me tell you that in this classes there is no uh, time pass at all. It's only and only pure learning. So you will not waste any of your minute very small short content is created for you which gives you good amount of productivity to watch and learn your topic that's all for the day thank you everyone see you in the next class everyone